While we were staying at the Leonardo Laura Beach Hotel, we decided to check out Paphos and we thought we'd travel there in style. So we rented some mobility scooters. It was only 75 euros per day and it could seat four. A taxi probably would have cost us 30 or 40 euros and it was nowhere near as fun. Anyway, we set off on our six kilometer journey, which took us about 40 minutes. The Leonardo Laura Beach Hotel to Paphos. You know what's gonna happen now, don't you? Like that. <laughs> <laughs> I am. What did you do? You turned a corner and I almost fell off. Hold on then. At least I'm providing some entertainment for people. Yeah. You can't say hold on after you've done. I didn't move. hold on then, did it? You, you need to give people three seconds for them to actually put their. Right. Hands hold on. Down. Right, hold on. Now what are you going to do? Go around to the left and then to the right. Worm. Yeah. Hello again. We're breaking now. <laughs> we got to experience seeing Paphos from a different angle. With the wind in our hair. We were very close to falling off, but we never did. We were out all day on them and they were great fun. We even let our five-year-old have a drive because that's really sensible, isn't it? Letting our five-year-old drive our mobility scooter without a helmet. Hmm. In case you're wondering, I'm standing up because I'm holding an invisible selfie stick that's pointing to the front of the scooter. I'll put a link in the description. Not the most sensible thing to do, but she was fine. She had a great time and we'd had a couple of beers at this point. The locals must hate these things. Go, 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 go. What is Rambo? We don't know yet. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> right, reverse, reverse, reverse. One of them plates. What are they? You want to have wood piece when the shoes? The beers? Yeah. The chocolate of plates. Whilst in Paphos, we decided to go and have a paddle in the sea. Hello. And it was Navy's very first time in the sea. The water was very clear and the kids loved playing in it. Yay! Yeah, it is, isn't it? Who's trying to fat? Who's there? 
looking for heart shaped stones. Yeah. <laughs> While Mummy and Daddy are playing tricks on people, Panny's concentrating on driving. When we were in Paphos, we hired a jet ski. We hired a jet ski from Octopus Water Sports, which is owned by Stavros Flatley. You know, the guy and his kid from Britain's Got Talent. They didn't win Britain's Got Talent, but apparently they were the most successful ones and they made two million pounds from it. Anyway, they set up their own water sports school here. Octopus Water Sports. Off they go! Stavros flatly for weddings and other events. Although I don't think the dad does it anymore, I think someone else is part of the act. We thought we may as well go and say hi to the dad, seeing as we were here. But no one else knew who he was except me, so we just kind of did this awkward little wave and scooted on by. So yeah, if you're in Paphos in Cyprus, Go and rent a jet ski from Stavros Flatley. You could tell it's him because of the tattoo on his tummy. Bye! As we were leaving, we found a hair braid station. And when you're on holiday, you have to get a hair braid. Oh, that's a, there you go, hair, hair braid. How much? 50 cents a centimetre. Where? Right, right. Oh, right. Um, this was honestly the quickest hair braid I've ever seen. And it cost 15 euros. Cool, yeah, it's very cool. Yeah. Yeah, wait, yeah. You like it? <laughs> yeah? Awesome. Thank you. 15. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. We found a cave. Okay. Woo! Ah! What's in there? Lions and tigers and bears. Oh my! Next time I'm driving. We've still got 30 minutes left and the battery warning light comes on. Yeah. Red battery's flashing. Yeah. Yeah. So it wasn't really going very well from here onwards, so we thought we'd do the only thing we could do in this situation. We ducked down low to try and go as fast as we could down the hill, like a pair of Muppets. Oh. 
Hello. Hello. We've run out of battery. Yeah. Uh, yeah, we're, we're on the main road. Yeah. So we called for help, an elf rescue turned up, and we got pushed all the way down the hill back to the hotel. We did really well with this buggy. We used it non-stop for eight hours. It's electric and you can charge it up at various different points across Paphos. But we thought we'd risk it. Of course we did. Finally, we make it back to our hotel, the Leonardo Laura Beach Splash Hotel. I'm very, very glad to see it at this point. If you want to like and subscribe, you can see our next videos, which also feature this hotel, as well as the Blue Lagoon and also Paphos Zoo. So don't forget to like and subscribe. Bye.